Hey, it's Margie with the Asking Spot, and um, gotta admit, this is not one of my normal videos once again, um, and it's because, well, I'm being a little baby. Uh, yeah, my baby left for college, and my oldest is in a program also, so they are both up in Illinois and here I am in Florida so pull yourself together and I know I need to get a hold of myself but I'm just kind of moping today uh feeling a little exhausted from yesterday you know getting up at 4 a.m to get him off to the airport yada, don't be yada. such a baby so um my project isn't quite complete I will have a video next week but um here are some of the things I've been working on with the embroidery I just you know so I can thank you for at least checking in um I did this piece and this is Edward munch and it's actually it was done like a long long time ago and i think it's just contemporary and super cool and it's timeless and i guess that's what makes a great piece but everybody's kind of like well who is that yeah well you might are maybe more familiar with his more classic piece um i'll just insert pictures but yeah he did the scream so uh, I gotta get a better frame for that, but yes, so that's why I did his piece. And then I also did one for my old home state of Louisiana. Had a lot of people saying, hey, what about George Rodrigue and his blue dog? He has done a lot of this blue dog and it's, you know, it's just, it's great. One of my favorite times of voting was when we had a sticker that said I voted and had the blue dog on it. I loved it. Um, but then I looked into it and I wanted to see when did he first start doing this blue dog? Well, it was actually in a piece uh, here's my version of it. It's a piece, so I'll get a picture insert. It was a piece that he did that was called the Watchdog. It was not called the Blue Dog, and it was based on his dog, Tiffany, that had just crossed the Rainbow Bridge. And he thought by making her blue, it looked more ghost-like. And I think he just did a beautiful thing with it. And then it just grew into this wonderful piece of art that he is famous for. So there you go. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm such a baby. But, um, you know, thanks so much for watching. We'll have a regular video next week. Thank you.